Yes. The Aetherians requested my assistance on this operation, considering my experiences of late. I suspect you are here for similar reasons, my friend. I'm coordinating the efforts to modify the gateway with our Aetherian counterpart. If successful, the gateway will function as a trans-dimensional conduit we can use to conduct our mission. We would appreciate your assistance in this endeavor. I wonder, did the Iconians ever do what we're about to do?
white vessel, I am Magistrate Malar of the Iconian Alliance. Declare your allegiance. Dominion? You speak of an entity that no longer exists. Explain yourself at once. Very well. I shall take you at your word. Should you betray us, the price... Board fleet ahead. We have work to do.
We must rescue them. Gaining ground with each 
for all. I will assist at this council. Was my understanding that the cavalry arrived on horseback, Captain? It's the 25th century, friend. We've upgraded. Right. The Iconians are in trouble. How can we help? This has been a day of surprises. The last time I saw you, your vessel was burning near the wormhole at the Battle of Bajor. How did you manage to survive? Ah, I see. That would explain a few things, such as the unusual looks you've been giving me since I arrived. I take it the Sela you know is different than the one standing before you now. We'll have time to compare dimensions later. Right now, the World Heart needs protection. The Control Borg are doing everything in their power to steal it from the Iconians. Sounds like you have some experience dealing with them. Good. We need every officer with that kind of experience we can get. Look, we've been fighting those very years since the mid-23rd century, and we're losing badly. 
The Iconian Alliance is all that's left now. The rest of the galactic powers have been conquered and assimilated. If we go down, there'll be no one to stop them from assimilating the entire universe. Let's hope it's enough. Keeping the world heart out of their hands is priority one. Understood? This is Captain Sela. We're on our way, Mitra.
make it. I apologize for doubting you, friends. Not at the moment. Give me more time and I can get her back on her feet again. It will take more than the thorn can muster to kill to get a Viconia. I sense more of the enemy approaching. Please protect us while I restore to get to battle readiness. They are coming! Please protect us!
Destruction was the only option. The enemy was about to take the world hard. You were in the right, Captain. Though the loss is devastating, we will fight to our last breath to stop the all. So vows to Ket of Iconia. There's still a Borg fleet to deal with. As long as that's the case, they can keep sending drones here until their victory is inevitable. We need to get back to our ships, now. We'll have to evac by shuttle. I'll have Enterprise send one down to a suitable landing zone nearby. That platform will make a good landing site for a shuttle.
Fire! We'll be here momentarily. Are you ready to go?
order to cross through the gateway was a challenge. But I could not stand idly by while others were risking their lives to defeat the Borg. Thank you. I am going to take Captain Dax up on her offer. I think it's time to face my demons head on, so to speak. For now, however, I believe we should return to our universe and update our superiors on the events of the day. was not in vain. His sacrifice, along with your efforts, will keep the Borg of that universe from achieving total supremacy. The battle for the Iconian Alliance is not over yet. Now that we know more about the conflict, we can send reinforcements to assist our allies in their struggle against their terrible enemy. A battle we once thought to be over may be just beginning. We must increase our efforts to thwart the Borg wherever they may strike. Through harmony, we are secure. Through unity, we are strong. <laughs> <laughs> 